25 people are recovering today from injuries sustained in Sunday afternoon's crashes here on Interstate 40 between exit 152 and 147. Fortunately, Master Trooper Chris Knox says no one was killed. You know, we're just so fortunate that, that nobody was killed. And I just, when you talk about that many vehicles and that much speed, it's, it's hard to imagine somebody wasn't killed. 136 passenger vehicles, four tractor trailers, and one passenger bus were involved in the massive pileup. The section of Interstate 40 eastbound was at a standstill for four miles after the first major accident blocked lanes. Drivers on the westbound side then started rubbernecking, causing more collisions. And fog also forms easily in this region near the river. Along with the slick roads and the sun's glare in between storms, tow truck drivers were slammed trying to clear the highway. This vehicle here was actually up on top of another vehicle that was wedged into the back of another vehicle. This was part of a, a three car pileup, but there were more than a dozen cars wrecked around it. On top of paying for the repairs to their vehicles, people involved in the wrecks on Sunday may also now face a fine for driving too fast for conditions. In Alamance County, Michelle Kennedy, WXII 12 News.